hi libra welcome back guys i hope you all are doing well today this is going to be for anybody with libra placements in their charts make sure you all flip and use the rolls take what resonates libra doesn't fit for your situation guys thank y'all so much for your love your support your donations and your super chats super thanks the love never goes unnoticed and i am returning that back to you all tenfold okay anything you guys need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box and please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms okay so let's see libra <clears throat> see what's going on with y'all all right, spirit guys, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses, please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Libra and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones are turning back to the sender. Block any interference that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Libras and protect me as I channel the messages here for my Libras. The cards won't come out. Okay, let's see what needs to be said, spirit for Libra. <laughs> What do you want, Spirit? What do you want Libra to hear or know at this time? What's going on for my Libras? What's going on for me, Libras? My beautiful Libras. Okay, Five of Pentacles reverse. Okay. Five of Pentacles in the reverse. So this is a replenishing of could be could be for some of you your health, your money. Some of you guys could be um, getting a new job here. If some of you guys were homeless or you were struggling or whatever, you're coming out of that time as well. Okay, something is is definitely going on with your your money. Okay, I feel like you're in this energy where you're also not feeling left out in the cold no more. Nothing can penetrate you to where you feel left out in the cold. I feel like your confidence is building. Okay, you feel more you, right? Like, yeah, the Queen of Pentacles, you're grounded, you're stable, you're secure. This is like um, resourcefulness. Okay, you're very welcoming, you're nurturing here. But I'm definitely getting something is balancing out with your finances for sure. Okay, for sure. Let's see. Some of you guys could be a healer. You could be an earth angel here with the temperance and the queen of pentacles. Okay. Yeah, the ace of cups. So a new beginning here in love. This could be you guys also tapping into your gifts and you tapping into your gifts here and connecting more to source, to the divine, to God, to whatever you subscribe to is definitely helping you replenish your, your finances because you're doing what spirit is asking you to do or you're... I don't know, you just tapped in, which is really good. I, I see a lot of abundance and blessings coming your way. This could be new suitors too. You have like new people in your life, uh, better connections. Okay, we have the Ace of Swords reversed. Excuse me. So somebody could be throwing you shade, Libra. This could be like animosity, okay? Or or um, some of you guys could be like in a hostile environment where you're at. But I feel like this Ace of Cups is overpouring or over overshadowing this Ace of Swords in the reverse. Hold on. Javier. 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 I was about to turn the TV down. Yeah, turn it down. Turn it down. You already know what I was going to say. That shit is loud. That's hell. Sorry about that, Libra. There you are at the bottom of the deck. Gemini, Libra, you could be dealing with another Libra, Libra. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I feel like somebody is, like, wanting to argue with you or they just feel this animosity or this hatred towards you or something like that. Like, this could also talk about confusion, a lack of focus. Um... Somebody that's frustrated or this could also talk about making the wrong decision. But I just feel like this is what somebody is throwing at you. Really. They could be trying to argue. They could be trying to argue. Hold on, Libra. Sorry, Libra. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so we're going to see what that is. Let's just keep going. Page of Swords is here in the Wheel of Fortune. Give me another one, Spirit, please. Five of Cups. 
Scorpio, Mars here. Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius. We got Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So you could be dealing with another air sign. Knight of Pentacles. So, yeah. I feel like you opening your heart, Libra, is what's going to bring in a lot of these different opportunities for you. You opening your heart and, um, you know, you need your heart chakra to be in balance in order for you to bring in abundance. Just period. So somebody here could be watching you with the page of swords. Somebody could be spying on you. Or this is like... You have your eye on a particular someone, <laughs> someone, or you have your eye on something. Somebody could be watching you to try to figure out how they're going to get out of this, this hell that they in. It's like somebody could be having problems with their finances, but yours getting ready to, yours getting ready to, um, pick up. Okay. Period. But let's see. Yeah. Will the fortune reverse? Bless me. There's a lot of abundance coming in for you. Somebody else is just mad. I feel like they want to argue. Somebody wants to argue with you. They want to fight. Okay. Because you're moving forward. They're mad. They're upset. And that's just what it is. Some of you guys are meeting... Uh, you're making better friendship. Like there's better friendships here, better connections coming through. People that uh, value you and see your worth. Okay, is what I'm getting. Yeah, the six of wands reverse. What the fuck is the five of pentacles reverse? I'm not spending too much time. This reading not gonna be long, Libra, because uh, I already know some bullshit gonna come up and I'm not gonna keep elaborating on it. It's, it is what it is. <laughs> two, three, two on a timer. So yeah, this is you coming out of your head here. This is like more positive thinking, okay? No more overthinking or self-sabotaging. I feel like this is you coming out of your head, literally. Whatever was restricting you or binding you or keeping you stuck, you, you, you're you coming out of it, for sure. It, which is going, this is going to help your finances move forward. For some of you, th this was some sort of like a work that was done on you here to bind your finances or to keep you stuck. You're overcoming that. You're not in your head anymore. You're not fearful. You're not scared or you're not any of that. Like, you're good. What's the Five of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, Reverse? Could be a Gemini here. Yeah, the Seven of Cups, Reverse. Some sort of illusion is clear. Yeah, some sort of illusion is clear. Yeah. I feel like somebody else is trapped. They stuck. They missed an opportunity with you. They could be feeling oppressed. Like, I feel like whatever's happening to you, whatever you're coming out of is happening to this other person. Whoever this other person is. But somebody's in for a big-ass wake-up call and a big-ass reality check. Just period. Some of you guys are also, like, sobering up here. You could be, um, you're not indulging in certain things that you're used to indulging, which is good, which is helping to raise your vibration. Yeah, what's the Ace of Cups? Yeah, the Six of Cups in the reverse. What's the Ace of Cups, Six of Cups reverse? The Sun reverse and the Five of Wands. Yeah, so whoever this is, like I said, they're in competition or they want to fight. This is like petty arguments or whatever this is. Somebody's like really, they had high hopes for something here, but they've been let down. They didn't expect you to move how you're moving. Okay. There will be no more, no reconciliation with this damn person. You're releasing the past. You're letting this shit go. The Five of Wands, I just feel like you're letting somebody fight with them damn selves. For some of you, there could be somebody in competition with the person that you actually like. You're realizing that. So you really let their ass go. I feel like, I don't know, for some of you guys, you didn't know or you didn't see it with the sun reverse. Like you wasn't enlightened or aware of something. But you see it now. Somebody here is miserable. This, this person is very pessimistic they're miserable and you know misery loves company they're just trying to rain on your damn parade here somebody can't let go of the past that's why they're still fighting and arguing whoever this is like anytime you find new love or anytime you get something new in your life this person wants to argue and fight and i feel like you see the pattern so you're not paying attention to it that's why they ask is in the ace of swords reverse yeah seven of wands blocked 
This is they 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 like that because you're not paying attention to it. You're not giving it your energy, which is good. Yeah, like what's his ace of souls reverse? Four of Pentacles and a judgment. Yeah, I feel like this is you protecting your energy. You're holding back. And you're going towards your purpose here. Some of y'all could be budgeting or saving your money here as well. Okay. But you're definitely stepping into your purpose. I feel like you're going through some sort of awakening. Where like if you were penny pinching. I feel like you're getting ready to be introduced to. Spirit is going to introduce you to a lot more options. Or another way for you to like do something. Okay. To better yourself and your finances. If that's your situation or something. But I feel like you're you're learning how to protect yourself and you're you just you're not sharing with somebody that ain't sharing with your ass. <laughs> just period. Yeah, I feel like you're focusing on self love, self care, and that's just what the fuck it is. Yeah. What's this four pentacles? <clears throat> yeah, eight of wands. Yeah, this is you moving forward. Yeah, the empress. Yeah, I feel like something is definitely getting ready to progress with your money here. But I see you moving forward here because you're holding on. There's something that you're holding on to. I feel like somebody's holding on to you, yes. But I feel like you don't give a fuck. I feel like you're moving forward. You don't give a fuck who's holding on to you. That's them. You are moving forward, and that's what you mean. Just period. So this is moving. Uh, you're moving forward in a very positive direction. This could talk about like moving or traveling here. You could be going to see the Empress. Somebody could be coming to see you, Libra. Or this is you getting ready to um, maybe just make certain money moves here. So you're saving, you're budgeting. You could be trying to make different kind of investments or certain things like that. But you're not sharing your energy with the wrong motherfuckers you're just not you already know i feel like if it bring confusion it's not for you just period yeah look the emperor to the empress <laughs> a perfect balance of energies yin and yang this could be counterpart energies you could be dealing with a counterpart yeah three of cups Yeah, seven of wands. So standing up for what you believe in here. Fighting for what you want. Having confidence about something. Somebody here is defending you, Libra. This could be your counterpart that's defending you. And protecting you from something. It could be because this person is naturally like changing. They're growing. So their energy is becoming more um, aligned with yours. You know what I mean? To where so they can protect you. They can fight for you or fight... Maybe spiritually. What's the judgment? The two of souls reverse. Yeah, you see where you want to go. There's a clear path for you. Um, You could be being tested here. Maybe for some of you, I'm hearing somebody trying to find the right time to express something to you or say something to you. But um, the two of swords in the reverse, I feel like somebody's in an emotional and mental turmoil with the five of cups right there, two of swords in reverse. Somebody's really tripping. But I feel like your path is clear. You can see something very clear. And somebody else is mad. They probably, probably uh, are possibly mad because they can't see where the fuck you're going. But you definitely have this, this sense of like self-awareness. You're not doubting your decisions. And whatever you're doing is solid. Like you're moving forward. You mean it. <laughs> Ain't no being confused or you not knowing what to do. You do. This could be like information overload here with the two of swords reverse. Like you could be receiving a lot of communication currently or you're getting a lot of downloads from your spirit team about something here. What's this two of swords reverse? This could also talk about too any leftover resentment or guilt or shame or whatever. You could be feeling, I feel like you're being tested right now to see if you're going to let this shit 
bother you or affect you or if you're going to actually like heal this with the judgment that could be you being tested to forgive are you going to be forgiving or not i feel like you are what's the two of souls reverse yeah ten of souls in the reverse yeah overcoming difficulties overcoming any obstacles challenges and if there was a curse or something here i feel like it's broken for some of you guys, your, your feminine has protected you here. If you're a man, divine feminine, you could be spiritual and you're protecting your masculine. Yeah, the four of wands, ace of wands, and the ace of cups. Wow. Hmm. Wow. I feel like somebody know, though, the worst is yet to come for their ass. They know that, though. You're overcoming something and something else getting ready to come back on their ass. Yeah. King of Wands reversed, Six of Pentacles reversed, Ace of Swords reversed, Queen of Swords reversed. What's the Page of Swords? The High Priest, I mean the Hangman and the Five of Cups. Got the Five of Cups here twice. Yeah, somebody's just like watching you to and regret they're sad or something like that. Because you're releasing them, you're sacrificing their ass. They are the sacrifice. You made a sacrifice to let their ass go and now they're sad. So all they can do is like watch you. <clears throat> That's all they can do is watch you. I feel like you see somebody differently now or or like you shifted your perspective and, and your perception of things. You know what I'm saying? What's the hangman here? Yeah, the Death card and the Knight of Swords. <clears throat> yeah, your focus. Knight of Swords with the Death card. You're going through some sort of change and transformation. I just saw one, two, three, four on the timer. You're going through some sort of change and transformation right now. You're like focused on whatever it is you focused on. You're going after it. This is like a lot of focus and determination and drive. That you had to get some shit done wherever the hell you're going. Yeah, like you're not fucking around. Somebody else is, and that's gonna be on their ass. Because you ain't got shit to do with it. They the one stuck. Yeah, like now they're the sacrifice. Because you're done with them. You are so done. What's the will of fortune? They can watch and spy all the fuck they want. I feel like somebody's watching you watch someone else or watching you watch something else. It's like, yeah, the justice reverse. What's the Wheel of Fortune justice reverse? Libra energy could be another Libra, like I said. Yeah, Queen of Wands reverse. Yeah, this bitch, they've been coming out a lot. They getting ready to get some bad karma. Whoever this is, they don't want to take accountability for what the fuck they doing. They don't. Aries or Libra here. Opposite signs, sister signs. Hmm. Yeah, some getting ready to move in your favor. And this person, they getting ready to go through it. Okay, whoever this is that's like bullying you, definitely definitely hear something is lined up where somebody was trying to be in competition with you or bully you or they were trying to stop something from coming in for you here. It has to do with like love and your maybe your money or like they were trying to block your gifts. What's the Queen of Wands reverse? Yeah, the four of wands. What's queen of wands reverse four of wands? The page of cups reverse. Mm, yeah, jealousy, envy. Somebody here that cares more about how they look versus actually being a good person. It's like page of cups in the reverse. There could be a distorted man here too. A distorted masculine here is watching you or they have other people trying to watch your ass. But this sun reverse is giving distorted masculine energy that's in competition with you in regards to your love life. Like they want to come back to you, but I feel like you don't want them. You're completely done. You've healed something too that has kept you stuck when it comes down to your sacral chakra energy. You've healed completely. Over the, You're over the betrayal or the lies or the bullshit. Like you've forgiven this person and you're done. You're forgiving a lot of people and you're moving on. That's why things are turning in your favor. Okay. Yeah, like. 
this could be somebody too in your community or somebody that's in close proximity to you that's jealous of you or maybe in a community where you work at or whatever this is. I'm definitely getting something here as canceled and then you're getting ready to go celebrate somewhere else. This person is jealous. Like somebody is jealous about a twin flame union or they're jealous about your stability, your security. Like somebody just need to get their insecurities together. They have a problem. Yeah, page of souls reversed. Child, what's this justice here? Reverse. Somebody could be jealous about how you're being supported or loved. They're just jealous. The Ace of Pentacles reverse, yeah. So this person, bad karma, gonna be them. They ass not get having no damn money. Uh, a missed opportunity, delays in their finances, or whatever this is. Somebody just don't want to heal. They don't want to take accountability for what they did. They want to keep blaming the shit on you, or whatever. And I feel like that's why your ass gonna be sitting here like this. I'm not gonna talk too long about them. I'm just really not. <laughs> like. I promise I'm not. Not at all. What's this five of cups? I'm also getting definitely something about kids too. But we have the temperance, the five of swords, and the seven of swords in reverse. Yeah, your consciousness kicking in here. Your consciousness is kicking in. I feel like you're turning over a new leaf. Like... I feel like somebody too is trying to steal credit for your work, uh, Libra. Okay. But I feel like you're healing and you're standing up for yourself. Just period. Let me see. What's this, uh, Five of Swords? You're being protected from whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, the, the Queen of Cups. You're standing up for yourself. I feel like you're nice, you cool, you all that. But you're not finna be you're not finna let this person play with you. You're a damn earth angel. You're not to be played with like this. And you're in your purpose here. You could be a psychic or you could do something in a beauty industry, or if you're a man, you could, you know, you could do whatever. But I feel like you're sitting here in this Queen of Cups energy. Your heart, like you don't want no drama. So you're not gonna participate in anybody throwing you drama. If anybody put their hands on you, I feel like you don't give a fuck about what somebody's saying. And that's what I'm saying, like, you don't care. And if somebody was saying nasty shit about you here, somebody keep on trying to take this lie to the grave. You're being vindicated from it. People are seeing clear that you're not to be fucked with or attacked. You're just not. What's this temperance? So this is divine intervention, protection, violence, peace and harmony being restored into your life here. What's the temperance? the fool and the king of pentacles for some of you guys you're getting ready to reconcile with this king of pentacles person and the fool could be virgo taurus capricorn or aquarius or sagittarius yeah there's going to be some reconciliation here with like just a little bit of time and patience but i feel like something is, is healing here between you and somebody this could be somebody that's coming in to support you or um Somebody is just getting ready to like take a leap of faith and go towards a new beginning. This could be this masculine's finances being replenished. Yours, I feel like it's already been good, but you could have had some sort of hiccup with your money too. But I feel like I, I, I felt like I was talking about a man. <laughs> yeah, what's the seven of swords reverse? Yeah, two of cups reverse. Yeah, somebody kicking in, somebody's consciousness is kicking in here about a breakup or like two people that are incompatible. Somebody's like really two-faced, really two-faced and they're just a loser that's got caught up in their own shit. That's all that is. I feel like this is about somebody here wanting to keep you away from someone and trying to keep somebody stuck to them for because they need money no give me a card here for legal spirit so we have behind a mask reversed optimism reversed 
Yeah, somebody's not having too much of a good time, are they? <laughs> They're not. Let's see. So we have choosing self-acceptance, but the card is in reverse. So let's see. It says when this card comes to you reverse, it indicates a wonderful alignment between your soul's identity and your personal view. You have or will soon come to the life-changing realization that you are completely valuable just as you are. There is nothing you must do differently in order to deserve your own or others approval. This single conclusion releases the striving, the performance, and the urgency that have blocked your goals in the past. When the mask comes off, the universe rejoices in your confidence and authenticity. Your unconditional self-acceptance removes the restrictions you put on your own energy, and that changes everything. So get ready for happier days. The results you've been waiting for are ready for the real you. Okay, I love it. So the affirmation is, I choose to accept myself as I am. I deserve my own high regard. And you are doing just that. That's why somebody here is losing big time. That's why they're losing big time here. I feel like somebody is after you, Divine Feminine, Libra, because you're help, you're showing this man something. This King of Pentacles. Sorry, I got a mosquito bite right here. I don't know why, honey, but that shit itch. <laughs> it itch. Yeah, somebody's trying to bully your ass because you're helping somebody here awaken or do something here. You could be a part of this person's purpose and somebody feel like, oh, well, if I if I kind of like beat this other person down, they won't be good enough or feel good enough for this connection that's coming in or for this money that's flowing in or whatever, bitch, that's you. <laughs> okay, that's definitely you. So two, 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 two on a timer. So you guys, um, this was your reading Libra. I hope this resonated for you. Like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you won't miss my reads and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.